Thank you for tuning in to another edition of the Vulcan Report. This report is an end of day report for trading on Thursday, June the 16th, 2016. Starting with the silver futures chart before you, you can see the amazing run up that we had up to the weekly resistance and it touched it couldn't break through it and immediately got smacked down by the central banks and at the moment that this was happening the inflows into the stock market were pretty amazing how everything turned on a dime the Dow was was collapsing and they decided to rescue the stock market by destroying the precious metals as you can see here it did so with increasing volume and then here we are coming down um, a better view if I can show it to you real quick here all right here you go on an intraday basis you can see it is perpetually hammered after hitting seventeen dollars and eighty six cents almost touching that eighteen dollar mark the market then got uh, got broken down hard just non-stop pounding for the remainder of the day into the into the close with even more pounding and selling going into the close um, just just brutal uh, market action in uh, in the silver today and you can see here gold didn't fare any better it was the same thing going on here in the gold after hitting uh, $1,319.80 it immediately crashed right after that just crashed down and you'll see the outflows here and then the inflows into the stock market as you can see here simultaneously at the time that the gold hit its high that's when the stock market hit its low at the same identical time then at that point that's when everything reversed here here we go we start here and then for the rest of the day just algorithms switching from inflows to outflows in the metals and vice versa here in the stock market you can see where it turned on a dime I'm going to show you how at the same time this was happening this same chart took place in the Bitcoin the stock market and Bitcoin reversed together alright amazing price action today amazing market manipulation today um, so stay tuned as we get deeper into that switching our focus now to crude oil crude oil just got pounded all day long as you can see just a steady downtrend here hitting 45.90 market still remains well supported though and the the, the punishment and manipulation just continues making the, the US government made the Saudi Arabian government think that okay once you agree to our terms then we'll take our foot off the neck of the oil market and allow it to go up some but no it's now uh, starting back down to its descent and I believe this is being done on purpose also to punish them more and to um, and to bring down the the oil uh, the oil price going into the election all pre-planned price destruction meanwhile the turning on the dime as the dollar was hitting its low today too look what they were able to do and this market actually I'm sorry this this was um, yeah this was this was early in the morning when they started this pimperation it hit it hit it hit its low 2 a.m. and then look just all day running it up all morning then they let the, the price come down a bit before rescuing it into the close they, they will not let this dollar drop it they just won't do it, it they were not gonna let it do but so much they have to maintain what's going on here and there's more to come but that's all we have for in this video stay tuned for the next video uh, where I'm gonna show you uh, more uh, than meets the eye remember bulls make money bears make money and pigs get slaughtered so take what you can give nothing back